him set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. And he takes a pitch that's ruled a strike at the knees. Pretty liberal strike zone there. It's 0 and 1 from the belt. Kicks and deals. And a pitch out. Nothing doing though. And that's ball one. Here's Trout waiting on the 1-1. One, one. Way outside. Nearly to the backstop. 2-1. Two and one. To 2-2 two and two now. Back-to-back -back sliders away. Now I think you have to think about running something hard in. Not a good idea to throw a good hitter the same pitch three times in a row. On to first, and for the second time in three innings, they've... So striding forward now, Tyler Flowers. He'll get us brain. going in the home half of inning number three. Tyler. Look out, Flowers. a fastball up near his dome, and that'll wake you up a bit. Wow, fastball up and in. I'm not sure it was intended to be that far up and that far in, but message sent, beware. Yeah, that looked like a strike, but let me tell you, when you're staring at a big zero in the hit column, getting a call like that to go your way can feel like a big victory. He's fallen behind now, three and one. Now a swing and a fly ball. But no chance to run it down. It's a foul ball. Well, that's back-to-back -back breaking balls. He's able to foul that one off. Will they come back with a third? And another foul ball. And he wasn't going to hit that one with an or. The strikeout, and there's one gone. Cutting ninth. Stepping in, Bartolo, Bartolo Colon, Colon, as he'll get his first opportunity in this one. Sinker to open the A-B in there for strike one. And then that's a pretty good example of why he's such a great pitcher. Yeah, stuff. Stuff is obviously the important key to being dominant on the mound, but it doesn't mean a whole lot if you don't have outstanding control to go along with it. But he does, now and batting. he really spotted that Center pitch. Fielder. So it was a swinging Ender. strike three. Bartolo Colon becomes the second out in the bottom of the third. Ender Inciarte is in for his second plate appearance as he looks yeah. at a ball. It's 1-0. and oh. Called one. strike at the knees, 1-1. One and one. Oh, That was a good pitch to hit. It wants that one back. He was just a little bit late on it. The 1-2 and two pitch. Again, he sends it out of play. Well, when you're hitting with two strikes, you're just in battle mode. Right there, he gets a breaking ball. He just fouled it off. Got a piece of it and stays alive. And he lays off it to even the count two and two. And he'll stay alive here, but just barely as this ball's chopped foul at the plate, and the count holds it two and two. A full count, three balls and two strikes. I got to commend him for being a really tough out right now. Not everyone will battle. Three. And we'll have to leave it there as this is. Anthony Rizzo stands in now. He'll try to get it going here to begin the fourth. Number 44, Anthony Rizzo. Takes a good swing, but this will be a foul ball. Here it comes. And that misses one and one. Here's the one and one pitch. Fastball misses in the dirt as he tried to get him to chase the low one. Into the windup. Here's the two and one pitch. Oh, and Rizzo gets on top of one and sends it in the air out to deep right field. And out of here. And I mean by plenty. That ball was crushed. The third baseman. Riding in once again, Manny Machado comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. And this is popped foul off to the right and back into the seats. Been a real big struggle for him so far on the mound. Four runs and only three innings. So it'll be interesting to see if he can settle in at all and make some adjustments or if this start will continue to run downhill. And smart to lay off there as the fastball misses. It's one and two now. And a fastball just a bit high. Well, I kind of wonder if he's not being as aggressive as he was before that home run. Hey, this is a guy that can burn you again, so I don't really blame him. Four runs, six hits, and no errors so far for the Nationals. And he misses this one inside, and that'll run things full three and two. Trouble waiting on deck as Bryce Harper hits next. Driven down the left field line. Will it stay fair? And this is going to be off the wall now for Marcakis out there. The tag, and he's nabbed, trying for two. 
Digging in for his second at bat, Bryce Harper. He's 0 for 1 thus far. Here comes the first pitch. A swing and a miss just out in front of that fastball. Swings through it for strike number two. Well, there's no doubt what he was thinking on those first two swings. Big power swings. Now he's got to dial it back a little bit and try to put that ball in play. Mine to the right side. Kemp back in plenty of time to put this away, however, and there are two gone. Ready for another chance. Christian Yelich. He singled his last time up. And that misses ball one. Into his windup. Here comes the 1 0. And this is going to find the crowd down the left field line. It's a ball and a strike. Even at a ball and a strike, here's the pitch. There's a line drive out toward the gap in right center. Heading for second is Yelich. And now he'll get into scoring position with two away. Now to the plate, Gary Sanchez. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Now some action in the Braves' bullpen as they'll stand up a right-hander to get loose. Swung on and missed. It's 0-1. For Yelich, that's double number three so far on the year. Line toward center field. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away. And that... Brandon Phillips. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. Tried to hold back, but this is popped up. Under it is Rizzo. One away. Stepping in, Hanley Ramirez. He drew a walk his first time up. Hanley Ramirez. First pitch here is a sinker that runs a bit too wide. It's ball one. Man, this guy has retired a whole slew right now. I think what he needs to do is just stay focused and keep attacking the game plan like he has up to this point because everything he's done has worked. Hit hard on the ground towards second. Throw to first will get him. Already two away here in the home port. So bases are empty here with two gone. And coming up, the dangerous right fielder, Matt Kemp. First offering on its way. Takes a knee-high fastball. I'm looking forward to this at bat right here, Matt. Two outs, base is empty, and you got the power guy at the plate. He's going to let it fly. He must. I guarantee you he will. Right there, and it's quickly 0-2 now. And he looks at a ball 1-2. and two. I'm pretty surprised by the location on those last three pitches. The book on him is that he hits the weight pitch. A swing and a miss. That retires the side, and that will do it. Josh Colmenter is going to take now over here in inning number five, so it'll be number a bullpen 55. game from here on out. Josh Colmenter. At the plate, Jake Arietta comes into this at Leading bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. The pitcher number 49, Jake Arietta. Swing and a miss that time. It's 0 1. Oh, 
on the ground up the middle. And the pitcher's got himself a base hit. So the leadoff hitter in the inning reaches safely for the Nationals. Digging in and looking for more, Jose Altuve. A couple of singles to his credit thus far. Now it looks like the Braves are going to get a lefty up and throwing in their bullpen. A breaking ball taken at the knees for strike one. That pitch right there just locked him up. A curveball that doesn't break, a little front door curveball. You're looking for it to go back out over the plate, and it doesn't. It just locks you up as a hitter. Called strike 0 and 2. Oh and two count. Here's the pitch. Nope. And that one stayed too low, apparently. Set to deal on a ball and two strikes. And this is on the ground to short. Could be two. And they'll get the fielder's choice play at second, but that's all. But they won't get two as he beats the relay to first. Seven. Shortstop, Ray Turner. From the stretch. And here's a ball hit in the air. Kemp is after it. And foul. Before the 0-1, he'll check on first. Runner back standing. Set to deliver the 0 and 1. A swing and a miss at the good old Uncle Charlie. Clearly trying to control the running game with the slide step here. Yeah, that's a good way of trying to control the running game, Matt. The problem with it, though, it has a tendency to throw your command off because you're worrying about that runner on base. Here comes the 0-2 pitch. Swung on in the dirt, strike three. Ready once again, Mike Trout, 0 for 2 on the afternoon so far. Ready to deliver, here's the first pitch. And here's a called strike at the knees. Don't think he liked that one too much, but it's 0 and 1. Hit hard on the ground to second. Phillips is there. Throw to first will get him easily, and the side is retired. Settling in now, Nick Markakis. He's 0 for 1 thus far. Left fielder, Nick Markakis. And he gets ahead 0 and 1. Matt, I don't know if you know this, but less than 60% of his first pitches have been for a strike. And he's still having a good game. I, I don't know what he's doing. They just haven't been able to figure him out. Rolled slowly to first. To his left, Rizzo. And he'll step on first for the out. Three unassisted. Now about it. Adonis Third Garcia baseline. digs in Adonis now. 0 for Garcia. 1 for him here in this one. And a strike called at the knees. Nothing in one. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 and 1. And a pitch in the dirt as he lays off. It's 1 and 1. And this is chopped foul near the plate. And the count will move to 1 and 2 now. And look out. He has to back away there and then give a little glare out to the mound. It's ball two. Pretty sure there wasn't any ill will behind that pitch considering he has two strikes on. Just got away from him from what I could tell. And the pitch. And he'll just get a piece here as this is chopped foul at home plate. And he looks at one that misses. And that's an excellent job of making his man throw a lot of pitches as he toughs out a wall. Shortstop. Dansby Swanson comes on with one away as he looks at a ball. It's 1 0. You know what, Matt? He's been getting most of the pitches. I know he's complaining a little bit on this one, but he's been getting most of the pitches today. He, he should be feeling pretty good about himself. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. Squared that one up just a little late. Well, he got a piece of that breaking ball right there. That's the second one he's seen in a row now, and he fouled that one off. Let's see if he comes back with a third one. Three in a row. We could see the runner in motion here on a 3-2 count with one out. There's a pretty good chance he's going to get a pitch to swing at. And if not, it's ball four anyways. Got him to go down swinging there. Dansby Swanson becomes the second out in the bottom of the fifth. Braves are still looking to break into the hit column here. Had him fooled there as this is lifted in the air out to left center and shallow. That's in there, and the Braves look to have extra bases on their first hit of the game. 
And they'll get back a run here as they're on the board. It's four to one. You're Pablo Sandoval. Pinch hitting for the pitcher Colmenter. Number 48. Pablo Sandoval. Down on the shins and missed with it. Ball one. Well, we'll give you a look there at the graphic. That's his first double on the year. Now a swing and a chopper foul right at home plate. And that jammed him a bit there as it's fouled at the plate. Lays off two and two now. Hoping to send him packing. Pitch on its way. That's in there. Base hit. Flowers. Rounds third and is digging for the plate. And the run is in to score from second. Ready for another shot now. Ender Inciarte trying to keep things Ender. going now with a runner at first following the RBI single. Called a strike on the outer half, 0-1. And, and this is going to be a foul ball in amongst the spectators. Lifted in the air to right field. Harper has a read on it. And the inning is over. Your Sam Freeman please. takes over to start the sixth inning on the mound. Ready for another shot now. Anthony Rizzo. Two home runs in two at-bats so far and looking to add to that here. First pitch of the inning is taken low and away for a ball. It's 1-0. Now the pitch. This is hit the other way out toward left field. Marcakis has a read on it. Looks it into his glove, and there's one gone. Ready once again. Manny Machado, one for two on his line so far in the game. Showing bunt here, but he takes ball one. Pitch on the way. One and one. That's a perfect pitcher's pitch. A high fastball out of the zone. You can't do anything with that. It's hard to even put any contact on that pitch. A little bit outside. Two and one. Hitters count now. Here's the two and one. And a liner foul into the seats down the right side. He's set. Here's the 2-2. Turned on that one and crushed it. Just pulled it a little foul. Even at two balls and two strikes, here's the pitch. And all oh, that looked to catch him flush down near the foot or the ankle. Safe after the recovery throw. Good effort, but now we have to wonder whether or not he's going to be okay. Stepping in and ready for another shot. Bryce Harper, 0 for 2 on his line thus far. And he takes a good swing at that one as this is sent down the line in right, but ultimately into the crowd of foul ball. And all oh, that gets him on the mound. Thankfully, he's able to recover and he gets the second out at first. In is Christian Yelich. He doubled earlier and carries a two for two line into this appearance. First pitch of the at bat. Swung on and missed, outclassed by that fastball for a strike. Well, I think his eyes lit up when he saw that pitch coming up at his eye level. Yeah, good luck. But hey, a high fastball all of a sudden becomes really dangerous for a pitcher if it's not spotted above the zone. A little height difference makes all the difference. And a good fastball. Digging in to try it again. Brandon Leading Phillips, he comes in 0 for 2 Second thus far. Basement. Brandon Phillips. And Phillips has himself a base hit. So the leadoff man reaches in their half of the sixth. Here's Hand. Now batting. First baseman. Hanley Mike 
Michael Gibbons place. will come on in now relief as he'll make his second appearance Number of the season 16. so far. Michael on the move is Phillips. Gibbons. And this is sliced foul into the stands in right out of play. And Ramirez can't get that one as he swings and misses for strike two. Action now in the Washington bullpen as a right-hander begins to get loose. Again, a one-two. This is popped high in the air toward the right side of the infield. Rizzo is under it, and he's got it for the first out. So here's Matt Kemp now. 0 for 2 with a couple of strikeouts right for him fielder. so far. Uh, he couldn't pull that one back as he clearly broke the plane of the plate, and that will be ruled a strike. This one's down to third. And that's going to be a base hit for Kemp. Riding in once again, now Nick Markakis, 0 for 2 here to start Nick the afternoon. Markakis. Ready to deliver, here's the first pitch. A fastball, and he swings through it to fall behind. And this is fouled back and out of play. He's ready, here's the 0-2 pitch. And this one's tapped foul at home plate. Here it comes, 0-2. Softly hit out to short. Altuve for one. Back to Rizzo, and they get out of it here. A double play to retire. Chaz Rowe is on to pitch from the bullpen now to start inning number seven. Ready for another chance? Gary Sanchez. He'll be tasked with starting things as we begin the seventh. Low for ball one. And the pitch. Grounded back up the middle. Swanson scoops it up. And the throw to first is in time, so the leadoff man is gone here to start inning number seven. The pitcher number 16. Michael. Andrew Your Benintendi will grab a bat and, and hit for the, the pitcher here. Number 16, Andrew Benintendi. And he'll take strike one on the fastball, registering at 93 that time. Good pitch right there from the reliever. Tough for hitters to do much with pitches in that location unless they're looking for it. And this one's downstairs. It's a ball and a strike. He's set. Here comes the 1 1. There's a swing and a ball lifted to left, but back in the seats out of play. It's 1 and 2. Well, he fouls off that fastball right there, and you wonder does he love his fastball enough to come back with it three times in a row? To two balls and two strikes now. Now a ball lying toward the alley in left center. But this will hang up just a bit as it's taken in chest Jose high Altuve. for a tough second out. Jose Here's the second baseman, Jose Altuve. He's looking for hit number three here in this at-bat. In there for strike one, 0-1. Oh lying to the right side. That's in for a base hit. He's now three for four. So the speedy Trey Turner gets a chance following the base hit. The speedy Trey Turner digs in now. He was sat down on strikes in his last at bat. Swung on and missed for the first strike. Now the 0-1. A wave and a miss, a tick behind a good fastball. He might have been setting him up with that high fastball to change his eye level. Now he's got him set up. Maybe he'll go down the zone. Good job to spoil that one away, and he stays alive. Well, I think he's trying to get that two-strike fastball out of the zone. Just caught too much of the plate right there. Fortunately, he fouled it off instead of putting one it in the seats. Yeah. Well, he went for the knockout pitch that time, but a good eye. One and two. Waved at and missed for the third out. Jump. Alex Reyes will come on and make his fourth appearance in this campaign. Number 61, Alex Reyes. Adonis Garcia is in for the third time here as he watches one that misses low. It's a ball and no strikes. Well, these hitters can expect to see a heavy dose of that big fastball from this reliever. It's a major part of his arsenal. And he'll stay with it here as he puts the, the squeeze on it seven, for out number one. Into the windup and the pitch. 
Dansby Swanson is in now as he watches a pitch for ball one. That one missed, but if it's a strike, I don't know how you get the barrel of that pitch. You have to really be sitting on it to hit a fastball coming in that hard on the inside part of the plate. And he pumps the fastball by him here. One and two now. Oh, a fastball swung on and missed. And for the second time today, he's gone on strikes. Next for Atlanta. Here now is the catcher, Tyler, Tyler. Flowers. He doubled Flowers. earlier in the game, one for two to this point. First pitch fastball off the plate there, and it's ball one. Swing and a miss as he ramps up on the fastball, one and one. Well, he's just two outs into his major league debut on the mound, and so far he doesn't seem nervous or like he's trying to do too much. That's easier said than done. Swing and a liner foul and out of play. Two and two count. Here it comes. And strike three called as he says. Lane Boyer will come on to pitch now as he'll move into the eighth spot in the lineup on the double switch here. Kurt Suzuki will also come on now as he'll move into the pitcher's number nine hold in the order here on that double switch. Hit the other way out toward right field. Under it now is Kemp and he'll make the play for the first down. Digging in once again, Anthony Rizzo who comes in two for three with a couple of home runs thus far on his line. A fastball off the plate away. It's ball one. You know, something to keep in mind, they're really burning through that bullpen, and this is only the first game of the series. Definitely could have an impact on the rest of the series, and maybe even the whole week ahead. Here's Manny Machado now. Two hits in three at-bats for him in this one. First pitch of the at-bat. Swing and a miss just behind a lively fastball. Way in front of that fastball. 0 oh and 2, here it comes. Swing and a miss as he ran that two seamer right by him for the second out. Here's Bryce Harper now. No hits for him yet in the game despite his team's offensive onslaught. And he lays off there 1 0. Getting late 4-2 our score as we play the eighth inning. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. Chasing after it is Inciarte. Makes the catch and that'll retire the side. Digging in. Kurt Suzuki. Leading off for the Braves. Patrick. Kurt Suzuki. First pitch of the at bat on its way. And now action in the bullpen as their closer starts to get loose out there. That's in there and he's deep in the hole now 0 and 2. And a ball popped foul to the right side out of play. The 0 2 once more lays off that time. One ball two strikes. and it's one and two here he comes on a ball and two strikes and oh we can't get out of the way of that one so the leadoff man will be on to open the frame Here's Ender Inciarte. No hits in three tries so far. He struck out once. That's lifted the other way out to left. Yelich is under it. One away. And he will scurry back to first as he'll think twice about trying to move up. So a runner at first now with one away. And stepping in the second baseman, Brandon Phillips. And a fastball to start things out here. Not close. It's a ball and no strikes. Now it's 2-0. Two, oh. two runs, four hits, and no errors so far for Atlanta. And here's a ball hit in the air. Harper has a long run, but he takes charge for route number two. Here's Hanley Ramirez. 0 for 2 with a walk for him so far. Hanley. Now a ball hit pretty well to left, but this is going to wind up in the seats foul. The 0-1 pitch. 
One and one. Man, he wanted that pitch, and I can't blame him. When you're facing a good hitter like this, you want that strike. You need that strike. It's 0-2 instead of 1-1. And he fires a fastball now for a called strike two. Pretty adamant about working him inside right now. Back-to-back -back fastballs, and that one was able to find the zone. And eight innings have come and gone now as the inning is over. Arotis Vizcaino enters from the pen to start the ninth inning as he'll try to keep the score right where it is heading to the bottom of the ninth. And this ball's going to find the seats down the left field line. Foul strike one. 0-1 count and the pitch. Inside with the slider and that'll back him up a bit. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. Swing and a liner. Foul. Hit hard down the line. Ah, oh, way to get dirty. Got him. So striding forward now, Gary Sanchez. He could really use a knock here. 0 for 3 in the game so far. First pitch coming, here it is. And there's one well above the zone for a ball. As long as you actually get it inside, that two-seam fastball running towards the hands is a really good pitch. Hit sharply on the ground. And he'll step on first for the out. Three unassisted. The batter, catcher, Alex Reyes. Elmer Gonzalez will get the call here as he'll hit for the pitcher. Number six, Elmer Gonzalez. This ball's hit in the air down the right side and out of play. 0 and 1. Here's the 0 1. Oh, and this at bat is quickly moving from bad to worse. It's 0 and 2 now. Well, he was clearly looking for a fastball right there, and that slider got right to him and went whoop, slid to the side. And as a result, he got an ugly swing and miss. Inside, as he might be trying to set him up here, 1 and 2. Liner toward right center. Kemp is there, and he'll make the catch to retire the side. Roberto Ozuna comes on now looking for a save Washington. here in the bottom of the ninth Number inning. So here's Matt Kemp now. He'll start things out against Roberto Ozuna, who for his part goes for the save in this one. And this is pulled foul as he was way out in front there. 0 oh 2, here it is. And there's a pitch that just misses the inside corner. And he lays off a pitch outside as they draw even at two and two. He struck him out the third time he's fanned in the game. Now at the plate, Nick Markakis. He's hitless in three at-bats to this point. And a neck-high fastball that time. Now a flare out to left center. Turner into shallow left. He hauls it in without any trouble. And there are two away. Adonis Garcia digs in now. He comes to the plate as the last chance for his side. Two out here in the ninth. But this is taken in as a perfect metaphor to end this one as that ball was hit hard, but the ball game is over. It was mostly pitching and defense in this one, but the man you see here made some noise with the bat, and as a result, he's our top player of the game. Well, he blasted a couple of balls over the wall in this one. Really put the guy.